First aid. Very important. Very important. And it's very important to know how to use first aid um, kits like this. And, uh, you know, take care of yourself and others. You know, you could have all the gear and medical supplies in the world, but if you don't know how to use it or what it's intended for, it does you no good. You could possibly even further injure yourself or who you're working on. So make sure you take some first aid classes or at least do some research, watch some YouTube videos, pick up a little bit of knowledge. I suggest you get CPR certified, so on and so forth. But first aid is very important, extremely important when you're at the range, you know, when you're driving in your car, when you're out in the woods, in the field you know, bushcrafting or camping, hiking, whatever you need to do, whatever you want to do, and extremely important in bug out, bug in, SHTF, and survival situations. You know, you're going to be doing a lot. You might be in a form of combat. Um, you know, you're going to, modern technology is not going to be working. Uh, we're going to be set back about 100 years, and you're going to have to do a lot more things by hand. And, uh, that increases your chances of getting hurt and injured, and uh, that's going to take you out of the fight, man. You don't want to be taken out of the fight. You want to survive. You want to fight to survive. So it would behoove you, you know, to stock up on supplies and know how to use them in all aspects. You know, food, water, medical, firearms, ammunition, you know, all types of stuff that you could use. But this review today is on the Adventure Medical Kits First Aid, and this is level one. And uh, they say it's good for one to two people. Uh, it is a pretty decent little compact but yet extensive kit. But this mainly, this is in my bug out bag. And I usually don't recommend buying pre-made kits because they're usually lacking in a lot of areas. And you're spending a lot more money than if you made one yourself. And you'd be able to include a lot more, you know, bandages and, and tools, maybe, you know, whatever, than you would get. In, in a pre-made one but I, I really like this one it's nice and red you know what it is it says first aid in big letters right across the top it's got a nice little uh, pull handle here uh, it's like a nylon uh, type of material it seems like it's it's water resistant just from the feel it almost feels like a raincoat or something like that and uh, it seems pretty sturdy and as you can see you know it's it's got some stuff in there and this I got off cheaper than dirt for seven dollars okay now, I know I keep reiterating the cheaper than dirt thing like I always will. You know, I know there are some places out there, if you really look, you can find stuff uh, a little bit cheaper than that. But as far as I'm concerned, cheaper than dirt, it's a mainstay. Go there. They got everything you could need for any outdoors uh, situation, any firearm, um, you know, purchase you're looking to make, ammunition, knives, survival gear military surplus anything people like us are in love with and for an amazing price it's literally cheaper than dirt you'd think they're giving this stuff away so here you go you know went over the case on the back uh, it gives you the list and the quantity of everything that's in it I'll read it off to you you could see it but uh, you got your easy care first aid and survival instructions so it gives you some pamphlets they're, they're, they're decent easy to read and it can help you out if you don't know too much or if you're not sure about something you got one slim rescue holler whistle uh, one compass button variety liquid filled for wound care you got 10 antiseptic wound wipes 12 bandage adhesive fabric 1 inch by 3 inch you got 2 bandages adhesive fabric for your knuckle 1 bandage adhesive extra large three bandage butterfly closer, four dressings, gauze variety, sterile, three by three inches, uh, four dressing gauze, sterile, two by two inches, one roll of tape, 10 yards, and that's medical tape. For sprains, you got a uh, two inch wide elastic bandage, and uh, blister, you got one moleskin, that's very nice to have, I suggest stocking up on more, uh, especially for a survival bug out situation, you're gonna be on your feet, and if those get wounded, you got to take care of them because that's, you know, that's your car. That's like getting the oil changed on your car. Eventually, if you don't fix it, it's going to burn out. Uh, you got a splinter uh, picker slash tick remover, uh, forceps, that's your tweezers, um, 
and then it's got some medications in there. You want to make sure you're uh, changing these out every every so often, but out of the box it does come with a little decent variety. You got two triple antibiotic ointments, uh, two afterbite sting and itch, re itch relief wipes, uh, four ibuprofen, 200 milligram, two antihistamine, 25 milligram, four pseudaminophen, 500 milligram, and two aspirin, 325 milligram. So it actually does give you a decent uh, bit of stuff in there, and for a very, very good and fair price, I believe. Here's the kit opened up. Uh, you can see there's your medical tape, there's your tweezers, your forceps, the button compass, the whistle, um, the uh, the sprain bandage, the elastic bandage, uh, so your medicines back here, and then all the different variety of bandages that they have. And there's still room to shove some of your, you know, some more of your stuff in there. I like the pockets. They seem they seem decently sturdy. They're only single stitched, but uh, you know you're not going to be ripping this up. And this is going to be on the inside of your bag, so it's not going to see too much wear. Um, I like the clear pockets. You could see through what you know what's in there. Um, just a very nice little kit. And for you know six seven bucks, what I paid for it, I don't think you could go wrong. It already comes, you know, bright red, so you know you know what it is. First aid, it's very identifiable. Identifiable, excuse me, identifiable. <laughs> identifiable. You know, I just like it all over. I think it's a great little pickup, and uh, it's a great way to be prepared. You know, if you're not so sure about you know making your own kit or what you might need, you know, buy one of these to start off um, and then you could add you know you could add some bandages you could add you know maybe a little pair of shears you could add more you know medicine you know whatever you think you would need but I think this is a great little way to start off and uh, this is by no means my my medical supplies in entirety for my bug out bag this is just one quick little compact kit that I can either grab and go with if I have to ditch the pack and or an extra backup to my main medical kit and uh, it's just it's it's very nice I really like this I could possibly hand this off to somebody um, if they were unprepared and they needed help or you know whatever so adventure medical kits it's the first aid level one they do have a level two and a level three they are going to increasingly get more expensive as you go up the chain but uh, for just starting off and just having a good kit to throw in your bag and uh, you know you could even carry this in the cargo pocket of your of your cargos or your tactical pants you know you could easily fit this in a sling bag like an EDC bag this would be great to throw in the glove compartment of your car you know or just have laying around the house you know it's a great little item right here and very inexpensive yet very thorough and uh, good quality stuff so go pick one up uh, build yourself a kit but grab one of these two and that's the uh, Adventure Medical Kit, Level 1 First Aid. And this is Terribly Tactical, reminding you to stay safe, stay armed, always be prepared, and don't ever think about treading on me. Peace.